What's up guys, it's Adrian and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna go over SoundCloud monetization. Why you are not making money from your streams. Now, I'm gonna go into a lot more details about this, but before we do that, I promised you guys that I was gonna analyze a couple of your pages, your SoundCloud pages. So let me jump right into that. I have two people's account that we're going to look at right now. So the first person's account is Milton. Milton's from Tokyo, Japan, and that's all I can get from this. Um, he doesn't have a cover photo. He has a animated photo as his logo. Um, first thing you want to do, Milton, is you want to have a cover photo that clearly shows your face. And in the profile photo, you want to also clearly show your face because when fans land on your page, they're gonna want to be able to connect a sound to the person. So the best way to build a fan base is to connect yourself with your audience. And you only have one, two, three, four songs already out. What you wanna do is you want to put out as much songs as possible. Every week I release a new video talking about a different music marketing strategy. Right now I'm talking about SoundCloud, but next week I might talk about Spotify or YouTube or Google. So uh, definitely subscribe to the channel. So Jeremiah, he has a great cover photo and he has a profile photo showing his face. Again, when a fan lands on his page, they're gonna automatically be able to associate him or associate his sound with a person. Uh, you can see where he's from. You can see that he's using a Pro Unlimited account. Because he's using a, because he's using a Pro Unlimited account, he's able to utilize the spotlight section. And because he's able to utilize the spotlight section, he can now uh, use site like repost exchange if he chooses to to repost other people's music but still have his songs on the top the one thing that you can do Jeremiah is to uh, have links linking out to your music where someone can buy your song so I always suggest to link out to somewhere someone can buy your song or download your music in exchange for their email address now to monetize your music on SoundCloud literally takes two seconds. And I'm gonna show you guys how to do that at the end of the video, how to actually monetize it. And the reason I love SoundCloud so much is SoundCloud is a great platform for new artists, new and up and coming artists, because it allows you to build a fan base. It is the only social media site for musicians. So SoundCloud is the best place for you to build a fan base as a new artist. It also allows you to put links under every track. So it gives you a way to drive traffic to your other profiles. So SoundCloud is a beast when it comes to that because I don't know any other platform that does that. Now let's actually talk about monetization. What is that? So basically monetization is SoundCloud paying out artists for streams that they uh, get for, for their music. But I see a lot of uh, people in the comments saying that they don't make that much money from um, plays or streams uh, on SoundCloud. And there could be many reasons for that. A lot of people may have ad blockers on, which means that ads will not play on their music. And you only make money from your streams or from your plays if ads are being played. That's the point of monetization, is giving SoundCloud permission to advertise on your song. And if they cannot advertise on your song, you cannot make money. So you can have a 100,000 streams and still make zero because you're probably using sites like Repost Exchange, which doesn't allow SoundCloud to uh, put ads on your song, or people who are listening to your song probably have ad blockers on. SoundCloud doesn't have access to run ads on Repost Exchange. So although it allows people to listen to your music and every time someone listens to your music on Repost Exchange, it counts as a play, it doesn't allow SoundCloud to put ads on your song. 
So how do you actually monetize? Now I'm gonna walk you guys through how to actually do it right now. So if you're using Repost Exchange, here's why you aren't making money off of your streams. When you put up a music on Repost Exchange, if you go to the campaign area, um, you have the ability to play someone's track. When you play someone's track, it counts as a play on SoundCloud. But since SoundCloud is not able to actually run ads on this song through Repost Exchange, you aren't going to make money for that stream. So if you want to make money and monetize your streams on SoundCloud, then it has to be organic. Now there's tons and tons of ways to get organic streams on your SoundCloud. Um, and one of them is you can get on playlists. If you get on playlists with a lot of followers, um, it's gonna drive tons and tons of streams to you. Now, if you want to know how to get on playlists, I actually put together a course that covers everything music marketing, and you can actually join the course from the link in my description. It goes over SoundCloud, Spotify, um, Instagram, and YouTube, and even Google. So it's gonna go over everything music marketing. So. Uh, if you want to be a part of that course, there's going to be a link in the description. So outside of that, um, you make about $3 per every 1,000 organic streams on SoundCloud. So the way you monetize your track is you go to the track, you click edit, and then you click monetization. Then you have to turn on monetization. So once you click turn on monetization, it gives you all the locations where you can monetize your track. So you just keep all of this on and you can either set a date when you want to start monetizing or you can just uh, leave it and it's going to always be monetizing. If you click uh, save changes, it's going to give you an error. And that is basically because you need to input a ISRC code. Now the ISRC code is basically your code for uh, that song and you get that from your distribution platform. So I'm gonna go over to DistroKid and show you. So on my DistroKid account, I have a bunch of songs that are released and you go to the song and then right here it says ISRC code. You copy that and then you go back over to SoundCloud and post and paste it in here. Say you haven't distributed your song through a third party uh, distribution platform. You can have SoundCloud just create one for you. So you can create an ISRC code for this track. This basically means that SoundCloud is gonna create one for you and assign it a tracking code for its platform. This way you can start monetizing your track. But I already have one, so I would copy and paste mine here. So I actually got an error that said I need to select the right shareholder for the track based on the location. So um, I'm gonna show you guys how to monetize on Repost as well, but it's giving me the option that I, have, I can uh, monetize on SoundCloud itself, which is my name, or I can monetize on Repost, which is SoundCloud's distribution platform. So I'm gonna show you guys that. Basically what I'm gonna do is I'm going to click one of these for every single area. And if I want to monetize on SoundCloud, I click Unseen. If I want to monetize on Repost, I click Repost. So now the other option for monetizing your track is by using Repost by SoundCloud. Now the way you do that is you go to SoundCloud Monetization. Then you click on your profile, and then you find the track. So it'd be this one, and you click Submit for Monetization, and then you have to, you know, if you don't have a ISRC code, you uh, click no, and then it will automatically generate a code for you, or you can click yes, and then go, again, go back to your distribution platform and then copy that code and paste it, and it will use that. And then you can put the label name and fill in the rest of the information, content rating, not explicit, um, English, let's see, what else? Okay. 
and do you have the right to monetize this? Yes, you click that and then you can click submit. So I don't wanna monetize this right now, so I'm not gonna do that. But this is the other way to monetize it. So you have two ways you have on SoundCloud platform itself or you have on repost by SoundCloud. But you cannot do both. You cannot monetize on both. You have to choose one. You have to either use SoundCloud or you have to use repost. Now the last thing I wanna talk about is payout. I made another video talking about uh, SoundCloud verification, you know, that check mark that you get when you are a verified artist on SoundCloud. Um, and again, you don't need that. So you can monetize your music without that check mark. So don't really pay attention to that. If you're a new artist, you can still monetize your music. You just need that ISRC code. Once you have the ISRC code, you can start monetizing. Again, for every 1,000 plays you get, you get $3. But only if you are generating organic streams. If you are getting streams from outside of SoundCloud or if you're getting plays from outside of SoundCloud, then it won't count towards your plays or towards your monetization because uh, SoundCloud's not able to run advertising on your music. So how do you actually get paid? So you'd have to set up your PayPal account with SoundCloud and then every single month they send a amount or they send your earnings to that PayPal account. So uh, if you haven't done that yet, go and set up your SoundCloud monetization, link your PayPal account to it, and then you'll start making money. And to link your PayPal to your SoundCloud, all you have to do is click the three dots on the top right then click SoundCloud monetization, and then you go to Premiere, and then from here, you fill in the information so you can uh, go into agreement with SoundCloud. You fill in your personal information, your payment information, um, your agreement that you signed, and set up your track monetization. So basically, in the payment information section is where you link your PayPal and that's how they pay you. So if you haven't done that, go ahead and do that so you can start making money from your streams. If you want me to review your SoundCloud profile for my next video, drop your SoundCloud link in the comment below and I'm going to pick someone to review their profile for next week. All right guys, so if you found value from this video, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and drop a comment below. Now if you wanna learn more about music marketing and growing your brand, then there's gonna be a link in my description that links out to my course which covers everything music marketing. So if you wanna learn how to grow yourself as an artist, go and check out that link. So if you wanna learn how to get more organic plays on your music on SoundCloud, then check out this video right here. And it's gonna show you how I'm able to get thousands of plays on my songs only a few days after releasing my music and it's all organic. So click here to watch it.